What's going on, everybody? So I want to wish you all a happy new year because it's coming up here in three days. And also happy holidays. Uh, you know, there's a lot of things. Christmas, uh, whatever you celebrate, uh, happy holidays. But I just want to thank you guys for all the support that you've given me in 2022. It's been an amazing year for the channel. There's been a lot of milestones that I've been able to hit and we've made a lot of fun videos and I cannot wait to see what 2023 has in store for not only me but the channel as well. I already have a ton of video ideas for the channel and I'm going to really try to upload pretty consistently in 2023. So just want to let you guys know that. Happy holidays. Happy New Year. Now let's go ahead and finish off 2022 with this little kind of fun video that I've been wanting to do for quite some time. So with Siri, there is a lot of different commands and things that you can say to her. Different things like jokes or maybe stuff on a personal level and get to know her and just all sorts of different things. Uh, so we're going to kind of go through a whole bunch of lists that I found online of different things to say uh, to Siri. So since it is uh, Christmas time and the holiday times, let's go ahead and ask her a few of those kind of items. So uh, let's go ahead and do that. Does Santa Claus exist? That's something I'm not allowed to disclose. I mean, disclose. <laughs> Little play on words there. Is Santa real? Well, reindeer and the North Pole exist. So things are trending in the right direction. Oh, there you go. Where does Santa live? He's in your heart and at the North Pole. Mostly at the North Pole. Here's one a little different for you. What should I get my mom for Christmas? Mithril shirts are great for orc-related activities. <laughs> so there's a few uh, Christmas-related uh, things there. Uh, so uh, let's go more of like on a personal level uh, to Siri. So let's see. Are you a robot? I'm Siri, your virtual assistant. Oh, she's not uh, saying that, is she? Are you a man or a woman? I am genderless, like cacti and certain species of fish. <laughs> what is your favorite animal? Software doesn't usually get to choose one, but I'll say Yorkies. What's yours? What's your favorite food? My preferences are constantly changing, especially when you edit them in settings. <laughs> okay. Oh, here's a good one. What's the best phone? Seriously? <laughs> That's funny. Windows or Mac? I'm pretty loyal to Apple. It's just how I'm made. Oh, man. These are kind of funny, you know. How old are you? Well, I came into existence gradually, but my first day as an assistant was October 4th, 2011. Oh, yeah iPhone 4, was that 4 or 4S? Please don't butcher me in the comments for that one. Okay. Uh, I believe you can divide by 0. 1 divided by 0 is what? The answer to anything divided by 0 is that there is no answer. So, that's my answer. Except it's not an answer. But it is. Right. Right. <laughs> okay, that was interesting. Tell me a story. This is the story of how Anansi the spider got his long Look at this. Legs. One day, he walked into town and smelled all the food his animal friends were cooking. He asked his friend Rabbit for some of his famous stewed greens. They're almost ready, Anansi, said Rabbit. Want to help me cook them? But helping wasn't part of Anansi's plan. I'd love to, Anansi said. But I have to do, um, other things. Tell you what, I'll tie my web to the pot and when it's ready, just give it a tug. By other things, a Nancy meant asking for monkey's beans, zebra's carrots, meerkat's garlic bread, badger's honey cakes, hedgehog's zucchini fries, or bark's ant casserole, and impala's no-bake keto bars. Before long, a Nancy was tied to eight cook pots and feeling very pleased with himself. It's not like all eight will be ready at the same... And that's when Anansi felt tugging at all eight legs. Ouch. <laughs> Soon, a very hungry Anansi stumbled home on his suddenly very long and spindly spider legs, realizing that if you stretch the truth, sometimes it stretches you back. The end. The stories she will tell 
are very interesting. <laughs> oh man, they always have quite the ending, don't they? Uh, let's see, what's some more? How do I look? Nice. I think you're ready to roll. Oh, good. What are you doing later? I don't have any plans, but I'm sure a few million things will pop up. <laughs> uh, will you marry me? Hmm. I don't have an answer for that. Is there something else I can help with? Will you? Oops. Will you marry me? If you love someone, set them free, and then stick to asking them about the weather. And stuff like that. Okay, well. Do you love me? You have my utmost admiration. Oh, ain't that sweet. Oh, let's see. Oh, we can also do, like, different movie kind of things. For example, I am your father. Something, something, something dark side. <laughs> Who let the dogs out? Due to unforeseen circumstances, that witticism has been retired. Oh. Is winter coming? Does a Lannister always pay his debts? Open the pod bay doors. But the cat will get out. <laughs> Do you like Pokemon Go? I like playing peekaboo with Pikachu. What does the fox say? Ring ding 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 ga ding ga ding. Oh my goodness. Why did the chicken cross the road? Because the little chicken-shaped light was green. <laughs> Do you know any puns? Whiteboards are quite remarkable. Well, that's pretty good. Tell me a joke. A teacher asks a student, If I give you four cats today, and then two tomorrow, how many cats would you have? The student answers, seven. That's wrong, says the teacher. No, protests the student. You're wrong. The teacher sighs and explains, four plus two is six. The student replies, yes, but I've already got a cat. <laughs> okay. What came first, the chicken or the egg? I check their calendars. They both have the same birthday. Oh. When will pigs fly? I don't answer hypothetical questions. Why are fire trucks red? Sure, it's to match the big red lights. <laughs> yeah, so there's just a few things uh, to ask her. I'm trying to think of some other stuff that I saw. How much do you cost? I strive to be invaluable. <laughs> do you have any pets? I thought about getting a tribble. Several, actually. <laughs> Who created you? Like it says on the box. I was designed by Apple in California. <laughs> okay, so those are just some random things to ask Siri. I mean, there's so many out there that this video could be probably an hour long, but Siri over the years, of course, has gotten better and better and still not all the way there, but they're working on it. But there's a lot of fun little things you can do and ask and talk to. And so that's just what I want to show you guys in this video. But anyways, I just appreciate you all again for the support that you've given me here this past year. And I just wish everybody a very happy, healthy, fun 2023. So with that being said, I will see you guys next year. Unless you're already watching this video in the next year. Oh well. See you guys then.